What's good, team? As you already know, there's a cute guy in front of the camera these days. It's my name and himself. And I'm back with another review. Back with another video, of course. It's been a while since I've did any reviews. And I've promised you guys, I'm gonna drop a lot of reviews for the month of January. But the month is already up. So, here we go. Like I promised, for the month of January. I didn't say when in January. Um, The reason why I've kind of hold back on the reviews, I kind of want to see where it's going in the long run, you feel me? Like a lot of people has been requesting reviews for different artists. But some of the artists that people request for, I don't feel personally like they need a review. Because they're not on that caliber. Like, they don't need that extra push as yet. If them, they gotta grow, whether it be lyrically, creative wise, production, you know, they gotta grow in, in different areas within the music. You feel me? So I don't feel like every artist need a review, but the ones I feel like need a review, I'm gonna of course review their music when the people request it or whether I feel like they personally need a review. So without further ado, let's get right into it. You already know what it is, man. So off the bat, um I'm gonna pretty much run down every video that I got. So off the bat, I got the artist level vibe vibes you feel me he got a track called roll it i honestly feel the track should call in young girl but i'll leave that to up to him but he got a track called roll it it's on the youtube channel you guys could go check it out i got it pulled up right behind me and we're gonna review that today we're gonna get right into it right now give me in general them collation girl give me in general the sweet and sexy girl and this is the reason I say you should call the track Indian Girl because that's how the track started for me. Like that's the catchy part. Give me Indian Girl, them collision, yeah. For that part alone, that's why you shouldn't name the track Indian Girl and not roll it. But as we go in, I could see why he called the track roll it also. Intro speaks everything for artists. Intro is everything. Yeah, intro is everything. And you know once you got a banging intro, that takes a song a long way. Once your intro is banging. And this right here is a banging intro. You feel me? Like a carnival, soccer vibe. You feel me? Anybody could feel it. Anybody could feel, you know, good to it. Let's continue. That also, you want a girl to roll it. So that also make makes sense why you would name the song Roll It. But in my opinion, I wouldn't name it Indian Girl. It's kind of a little more catchy. Yeah, it's a little more catchy, like Indian Girl, you feel me? But it is what it is. It's still, it's still a good song at the end of the day. Everybody know, guy needs to make the best roti and curry, especially the Indian side. I even got me an Indian girl, bro. I can't be mad at you, guys. I can't be mad at you. I got me an Indian one myself, so I understand where you're coming from, you say. We all need an Indian girl on we size for. And plus, I got a guy in his Indian, so you know. I get the roti and curry, tal puri, um, vamazeli, all the extra thing that come with it, you say, man. Yeah, man. I could see I could see performing this on MASH. Now if he don't get booked for MASH just after this song alone, I pray for guy in the music industry. I pray once again for the industry and the the guy in the music industry. He from this song alone he should be getting booked. At least for match day, you feel me? And I know they got a soccer money coming up and everything. He should be, if not running, he should be in the lineup, you feel me? He should be in the lineup. <laughs> One thing I like with Guyanese music, we could take stuff from other music and other cultures and all that and incorporate it in whatever we gotta say, you feel me? Which is one good thing about Guyanese music and a bad thing also because that leaves us with a broad spectrum that we don't have our own sound. But the fact that you could take everybody else's sound and kind of make your own, we kind of do have our sound, which is everybody else's sound. 
You feel me? So I I like that little part. That remind me. I can't even remember the exact song it come from, but that remind me of that old school song that we used to sing back in the days. Roll up your bumper, roll up your bumper, me sasa, hop your pay. You feel me? Yeah, I know a little Indian vibe. Roll up your bumper, me sasa. Black girl, them roll up your bumper, roll up your bumper, me sasa. I'm a ringer, roll up your bumper, roll up your bumper, roll up your bumper, roll up, girl. could just see the song on March Day like just big trucks everybody in them costume and everything and this song this song got to be a song that play in that for March Day for guy in a carnival cuz I know we got carnival now this song is a song that got to be playing G it's like trust me this this is one of the song that we need on the truck like I remember back in the days when, when we had March we used to play um there's my night is my to the man, there's my height is the man and then you saw a bunch of other Destro and Patrice Rock Patrice Roberts, if I'm correct, um, Marshall Montano, and a, a bunch of other artists, you feel me? But it's like certain type of music that's just suited and set for the mash pace, you feel me? And this is definitely one of them, so this definitely gotta be playing on mash day, representing for Guyana, of course. Give me Indian girl, them collation girl. Give me Indian girl, them sweet and sexy girl. Give me Indian girl, them collation girl. I like that breakdown right there. Roll it. Mad breakdown. Roll it. 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 That, that little breakdown, the way he does like roll it. Roll it. That breakdown right there. That shows his creativity level is on is on, is different. His you know the way he structures lyrics and everything. The way he composes the song and the producer also. I'm pretty sure it's AJ produced that. That shows you know they know what they're doing. That's what I like right now in Guyanese music. They these artists. A lot of them too, they know what they're doing with the music. You feel me? They just need an extra push. And of course, I'm here to help. But, you know, I could only do so much. You feel me? But they need that extra, extra, extra push. You feel me? To take them to the international level. You feel me? This is a song that could pop international. This could be playing in New York during the Soko, Soko events. Canada, Barbados, Trinidad especially. You feel me? Like crap over, Carnival, all them stuff. This, this, is, as, is, this is a song that should be playing worldwide. Representative for Guyana Carnival. And Carnival in general sound like the ending right there that was the ending like i've been in music too long for not knowing when it's when it's about to end you feel me um i want to start rating music like I, I did it with a previous review so i want to continue doing it um out of 10 this is this is definitely a 9.5 you feel me out of 10 this is a 9.5 rating production is on point the lyrics is on point i don't feel like it had too much i don't feel like it had too little so for that production is on point Lyrics is on point. The whole, the general composition of it is is, is nice for the team and for the, the the time that's coming up right now. Do you know the carnival season just begin? It's perfect. You feel me? It's suited for the right moment right now. So nine point five out of ten. Artist name Level Vibes. Track is called Roll It. I still feel said the track should name Indian Girl, but we could agree to disagree on that. You feel me? It's doing pretty well on, on the YouTube channel. You guys, of course, should go check it out. Shout out to AJ on the production. If you're gonna do a video to this, bro, honestly, you should wait until March Day to do a video. Like I said, have the music playing on the big trucks and everything, blasting. Because I don't even turn up my speakers, and I know it got a good bass behind it. You feel me? So, if you plan on doing a video to this, March Day is a perfect day to do a video for this track. If you don't do the, the, the video, your match day don't do the video 
it's not gonna be worth it trust me oh yeah 9.5 out of 10 production everything covered general point of it it went out good i like the track personally for the season i like the track for the season it's not something i listen every day but for the season yeah the carnival season so that's that's pretty good um if i'm right this is level vibes first review from the real esteem so thumbs up to that bro you already know respect to aj for production shout out to the whole guy in the camp you feel me shout out to everybody working shout out to all the artists that's putting in work on the overtime on the double you already know team my rose life of viral i'm not gonna go much into this because not much it's, it's a feel good track ain't much i could say about it so we can cut the video right here right now life of viral team my rose shout out to level vibe y'all go check out the rest of the music link in the description below or you just type in level vibe slash high rollers all this music is gonna pop up you already know because